Here we're going to show you an alternative to default next-gen reports and how simple it is to set up a next-gen cube report. Now what you're looking at is the basic relative value unit report we have set up here and we're going to recreate it in a cube using Excel. So first of all let's open Excel and we'll set up our connection with our database so we can grab the data directly from the source. And it's just sitting there on our server there. We'll make that quick connection to this cube. Now what you're looking at here on the right side is all of our values or all of our data and all of the different views you can slice and dice to see how the you can create these various reports. Now first on that old report we have our charge amounts as well as our charge quantity and our RVU total. Now we want to see this for the, just the month of March within in, in 2011. So we'll go ahead and filter the report by 2011. Select March. And here we have our totals for March, but we also want to see all of the doctors. So we'll go ahead and find the rendering provider and select the provider ID. And now we also want to see the departments that are affiliated with each of those providers. And there we are. Um, now let's go ahead and filter this report and just see the doctors with the last name or first name H. Go ahead and use the search bar again. Now we have this report here and let's go ahead and compare the values. We have 93,418 and 37 cents for the charge and 600.66 for the RVU totals. As we can see, they're perfectly matched up. Now, another great thing that's nice about these reports is we can see various views, or in this case, let's use a hierarchy so we can see the detail level of these, of these different um, departments. And in order to do this, it would take a very long time to do in, a, in your regular default next-gen reports. And once we have that, we can go ahead and save it as a general Excel file. And whenever we want to see this report again, we open it up and just refresh the data and it grabs in all the data from the database. And as you can see, the Excel cube reports are a slick alternative to get the data you need from NextGen.